Roadside thefts continue to burn taxpayer dollars here in Marion County, but investigators telling me, more importantly, it's creating a potentially deadly driving hazard. We have a lot of hills and curves in Marion County, so those stop signs are there for a reason. They're not just up to, to add to the scenery. The thief targeting signs located on gravel county roads, specifically in northeast Marion County, south of Pella. Crews recently replaced a stop sign on Keokuk Drive and 250th Avenue. And just down the road, the stop sign and post swiped on 245th Place. It could be pranks. Pete Rosendahl drives these county roads daily. The biggest question would be if there's an accident, who would be at fault because they actually wouldn't know who was supposed to stop. Marion County law enforcement is investigating eight stolen signs in eight days. They include stop signs, stop ahead signs, and road closed signs. Disappearing warnings now creating a roadside risk. There are people that walk our gravel roads and if you come over a hill and you don't see that stop ahead sign or you don't see that stop sign, there is a real potential someone can get hurt or killed. 12 years ago, a Polk County man lost his life after a collision on Highway 316. The stop sign that should have stopped Austin Gilliland was reportedly stolen just hours before the crash. These are riveted on and I'm guessing they were able to get one of the rivets out. County workers keep a stock of replacements ready when needed, but are counting on investigators to catch the suspect. If you have any information regarding this crime, call the Marion County Sheriff's Office at 641-828-2220. Reporting from Marion County, Ryan Smith, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.